Well, the attack certainly hit close to home for Oregon's Republican Congressman Greg Walden. He said Congressman Scalise is a friend and said social media is allowing people to share their anger like never before. KGW's Pat Doris talked with him and others today and joins us now. Pat. Well, it has definitely been an interesting day at the Capitol and Congressman Walden called the shooting horrific. And the, he said it was as unexpected as the attack on Portland's MAX train. He also worries about the anger now that's on display in America. Greg Walden said it's easy to find anger focused at politics on social media. Then um, what I'm afraid what we're seeing is some of that uh, online anger beginning to spill out in, in person. Walden considers the wounded congressman a friend and said he's praying for him. Tweets from the Portland area today show many still sharing their feelings online. This one says Republicans spend half their time defending guns, the other half promoting them. Another reads... Those proclaiming we need love in this country are the very ones perpetuating the hate, division, and violence. Here Portland State Political again. Scientist Ron Tammon says we should be disturbed but not surprised by the violence today. Violence has always been a part of American society. Uh, we are feeling it more because of social media, and we're feeling it today. He said some of the anger people feel comes from stark differences between the political parties. But there is more. Some political leaders have said, it's okay to speak your mind. It's okay to have your biases out there. It's okay to wear your anger on your sleeve. And that's also part of this backdrop. I tried to ask Congressman Walden about that. I've heard some point the finger at the president for his rhetoric and sort of letting the genie out of the bottle. Do you think any today, of that? Today is a day to focus, um, not on motivation. Today is a day to focus on those who are fighting for their lives. Those people were on the minds of many today, including Oregon's Democratic Senator Ron Wyden. The FBI took to social media today, speaking of social media, asking the public around the country to share anything they know about today's gunmen. Back to you.